Hi everyone! I am back with another Woolen Yarn Box reveal. This is the November reveal. So for those of you who kind of um, have been with us from the beginning, you will have known that the Woolen Yarn Box started as a mystery box. We have since transitioned over to showing you the beautiful boxes uh, prior to the ship date. So like you'll know what your box is and then you can make changes to your subscription if you'd like. Um, or you can make plans for your patterns and what you would like to make with your beautiful box contents. Um, in order to do that, we've had to do an extra reveal today. So this is our November reveal. It is a little crammed in. It's with the apple cider box. They're kind of going hand in hand with their pre-order at the moment so that we can fix the reveal slash ship date now that they're no longer a mystery. So thank you for your patience with that. This will be the only time that occurs after this. Everything will occur on the 7th. Billing, shipping, and reveals for boxes starting October 7th. That will be the date that everything happens for a woolen yarn box. So uh, without further ado, I will tell you what the November box is. So we are sort of celebrating the golden hues of November, right? You have the gorgeous golds, burnt umbers, browns. And we thought, what really kind of is out there with theme? And like, where can we visit to places you knit? And we loved, we were torn between two, but we loved a museum. Uh, so visiting a museum, we thought of these golds. And we thought, what is more striking than when you go to the museum, there's like an ancient Egypt uh, exhibit sometimes, like depending on where you're at. And we looked up the Lost Golden City uh, and that surely celebrates gold. So we went with like the uh, Sphinx and the Pharaohs and the golds and browns and sort of like those earth tones that you get in their pottery and things like that. Uh, and so we are visiting the Lost Golden City exhibit at the museum for places you knit and crochet. So I guess I'll dive right in and show you the, um, the yarn for this one. So the yarn for this, like I said, is inspired by those earth tones. They sort of painted the top of the, the boxes that held those mummies and they painted their pottery and the different items that they kept in the pyramids when they, when they, uh, pr when they preserved all of this, right? Cause they thought that it was going to go to the afterlife with them. So I wanted to celebrate not only the golds, but I wanted to bring in those earth tones. After all, like November, that's what it's all about. So here is the sock set. How gorgeous is this for November? Absolutely stunning. Really stunning. It not only has the golds, but if you look up close, it has that burnt umber color. There's that nice color there. It's got this smoky green and a little bit of this like muted blue gray slate kind of color, which I really think brings a lot of depth to this. And then that smoky green is carried through with your 20 gram mini. Um, so this is the Lost Golden City. And just picture you're taking in all the color, the history, the art, the artifacts, and all those golds that it has to sort of give off. And you're sitting there and you grab your needles and you can knit up the Lost City of Gold. Make matching socks, perhaps a shawl. Very, very earth tone-esque, really pretty for November. And your bag matches, right? So mommy brought in that gorgeous, gorgeous gold tone. She hit it in the park with this one. And then it's got that really pretty uh, smoky green in the back. So really ornamental for this like batik fabric that she got. She carried down here with that nice dark brown that November is sort of known for. Gold. Really, really gorgeous. She gave it a really nice gold tie and on the inside just a nice neutral carry through so we don't take away from the, the gorgeous ornamental outside of the bag. Really roomy, box bottomed. It's a sock sack this month, really gorgeous. So your bag, and it has this gorgeous handle. Look at this, like uh, it's kind of shiny, which really goes with like that gold 
theme, right, for ancient Egypt, for the exhibit. And when you think of a museum, you think of like the, the old time artifacts and all that history, and this sort of like screams that. So there is your yarn and your bag. Absolutely love that. Uh, this month, you're going to get a lotion bar. We do alternate between a lotion bar and a wool wash, but this month is going to be a lotion bar. Uh, the scent is going to be reminiscent of something old, right? Uh, we want to kind of smell the history. Same thing with your eight ounce candle. You get a candle in your box every month. Um, and if you don't get the lotion bar, you get a wool wash, which I've shown you for the apple cider uh, reveal. So if you haven't checked out the Rhinebeck apple cider donut box uh, previous to this video, check that out. Um, you get an apple cider soap in that one. But this lotion bar is going to smell like something old but delicious. <laughs> and then your 8 ounce candle. So you can definitely burn this candle for quite some time while you knit on your gorgeous golden set. Store it all in your gorgeous bag. We have charms for this set, which are a sphinx and then an old time pottery set. Uh, which I'm going to insert here and it'll show you just how I mean Sammy is so detailed this sphinx like I can't even she just made the most adorable little sphinx and the ornamental detail on it is fantastic it even has like sapphire looking eyes uh, and the gold on the little pottery just hits it home it's like she went into a pyramid and plucked out two miniature little artifacts um, so really really fun this month really out there and I think I think it's just like really fall you know you really want those colors in November we're heading into like that season where you'll start to think about Christmas knits um, but I'm really still I love fall colors and I think these golden hues really hit it home your extra for this your extra for this month is going to be washi tape uh, we're going to carry through with that gold theme and yours might vary. We have a bunch of these. Your extra for this month is going to be washi tape. And we're carrying through with that gold theme. Uh, it may vary from this one. We have a bunch of them. But you do get a washi tape in your box. Uh, one or two rolls. Something like that. Um, but we are going to carry through with this really gorgeous gold theme in some manner. So uh, washi tape is your extra. And yeah, it just makes an absolutely beautiful set. So if you like the whole works, you can get your yarn charm bag extra and your candle with your lotion bar or your soap. Or if you want just the basics, we now have the basic box where you can get your yarn charms and your extra alone as your basic box if you're not into the soap lotion bar and candle. So lots of options. If you ever want a base change, please contact us. We try to work with you. If 8020 Superwash Merino Nylon Blend isn't your thing, you want DK, we have 100% Merino DK, uh, DM us, leave a note, contact us by email. Email is probably the best way and communicate with us at least two weeks prior to the 7th and we will try to accommodate to make your, to make your set. Um, we can't promise anything if you do it really close to that date or something and they've already been created. Uh, we'll let you know. So just contact us, but we do try to work with you. So if you'd like a different base, please let us know and we will try to accommodate that. Okay, so head over to WoolenWomenFiber.com. Join in on the Woolen Yarn Box subscription. It takes you to places you knit and crochet every month from your favorite place. Uh, such as your couch at home or a favorite knitting chair, however you do it, if you have a craft room like I do. Uh, and you can transport yourself directly to a new place every month as these colors, smells, and feels, they all take you to the place you're knitting that month. So lots of fun, uh, really good buy, and we have free shipping on all of these. So it's a, it's a great deal. So check it out all on willowwomenfiber.com. And I will see you October 7th for the next box reveal. Okay, bye.